Hello everyone, what is cooking all you good looking people out there and welcome to another exciting episode of FTL Advanced Edition and here we are going to start off an exciting new episode. Now we've uh, gone through all the ships, uh, the Kestrel, uh, now since the last time I haven't actually uh, played very much. I've uh, been uh, busy, you know, I've just I've just been busy, a lot of school stuff, a lot of uh, God, trying to trying to stay awake because my God, been feeling tired the last couple of times. But now, uh, last couple of days, times is a weird way to say that. But now, you know what? It's time for a good old FTL run. Very excited to do that. Let's get do a recap of how we did. Uh, we had a failure as uh, the Kestrel. Uh, well, we started off. I started off the series by doing a bunch of mixed runs with the Kestrel. Didn't really work out. Um, and then we did a run with the Kestrel when I started getting kind of good. Didn't work. Uh, did a run with uh, the NG ship. Didn't really work out for us. Got a success as a stealth cruiser. Victory on normal. Then a victory as the Adjudicator. Last episode, failure as the Federation cruiser. Now we're going to go for the... Um, since we had a failure last time, I really want to uh, do something, maybe give a, give me a little bit more chance. You know, we've gone through quite a bit of the ship, so I think might as well uh, talk some off the list. Some of these are, are pretty hard to go through. I, I can't imagine myself having a good Mantis Cruiser run uh, on normal right now. But uh, let's try for an offensively powerful ship, because that was really what was lacking last time. So we're going to go with the Lanius Type B Cruiser. Um, with its advanced flat cannon, seems like the perfect opportunity for a powerful ship that we can really get behind. So I'm quite excited to be uh, participating in this. This should be quite fun. Normal, absolutely. And uh, why don't we start this off? Okay. So here we are. We don't have vision on our systems yet. But uh, what I can do is I it's paused. So I can open and then I can just drain uh, the oxygen out of everything right now because, you know, because I can. Uh, then uh, our little friend here uh, can go wherever they want. Actually, you know what? I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep uh, these two rooms right over here as safe rooms for our character here. Just in case I ever need to um, myself go uh, into an oxygenated room. Let's see, there's a fire here or something like that. I can go into any one of these safe rooms right here. Uh, what I can do is I can power this on. Other than that, not much I can do. We do have mind control. Cool stuff. We may be, well, we're going to be using mind control all the time. Uh, but for right now, well, that is if we do have uh, sensors, which we don't. So we actually probably won't be using this for quite a while. But uh, why don't we just go? I mean, advanced flak is very good. It's better than the regular flak cannon because it has a um, shorter time uh, that it takes to um, fire. So it is a very offensively powerful weapon. Okay, let's uh, distress signal coming from a small space station orbiting an uninhabited planet. Defense has gone to haywire. Let's promise to help. Uh, since we have an NG crew, let's remotely repair its targeting system. 20, 3, 1. That's very good. Right off the bat, we got some good stuff. All right, now let's move on to uh, this location, see if we can get ourselves into a little bit of combat. As soon as you arrive, you receive Federation encrypted message. Rebel ship is terrorizing local civilians. Uh, let's go looking for the ship. We have found it. Uh, they're going to have a boarding drone, which... Uh, I, oh, no, that's not a boarding drone. I thought it was for a moment, but um, it is not. Is that a, a laser fire beam? Uh, if it is, then we have nothing to worry about. Uh, be, yeah, that's not going to pierce anything. So, great, we're just going to win this. Um, very nice. I might as well auto-fire right here. And uh, let's go for their shields now that they're going to be uh, repairing stuff. So we're going to be firing on that. Then we're just going to go... Um, uh, let's just continue out on the shields. See if we can do anything. So let's go try and pierce those. Honestly, uh, seven missiles is a whole lot, but we don't need missiles, so we're not going to accept surrender. Seven missiles is like so much for this early in the game, but um, we don't need that. Lasers are totally fine with us. We uh, can, you know, we've got a lot of uh, defense against just one crappy laser. 15, 3, 1, continue. That's all we can really do for now. So why don't we go over here and try and make it down to. Um, Oh, goodness. Okay. So, oh, okay. I see. I can access it from over here. So maybe I'll have to go through um, through this stuff over here. Maybe I can make it uh, into this and maybe... Oh, God. That would be such a long way around. Hmm. It's a tough call. Let's just go here then and uh, try to see what we have next. Okay. So we arrive in an asteroid belt. We've got, uh, we've got some evildoers. They've got a... Uh, that's a beam drone, right? Is that a beam drone? 
I really hope it is. Okay, well, I'm gonna just shoot on there, and we're gonna hope that this doesn't wreck us. Oh, God, it's gonna wreck us. Okay, well, that's okay. We're just gonna go send uh, somebody else here. Don't you laser much more of us. These uh, Lanius are quite annoying, and uh, we're just gonna go shoot uh, right on there. Uh, hoping, okay, they did two damage. Come on, just fire off. Oh, nice, that got destroyed. That's really good, actually. Nice, their weapons are offline. Uh, what I want to do now is I don't care about their beam anymore and their weapons are gonna take forever to get back online Sure, uh, you know a little bit a little bit of annoyances here. We're oh my god Did I just did I just seal everything back up? I did now their shields are down. I can go over here uh, What I want to do is I want to open everything close this and then just kind of open uh, These ones over here. I accidentally uh, what I meant to do was do that which is a lot more uh, logical. All right, let's hope um, the shields are down completely. Let's go fire on the beam drone. Boom. Okay. Oh, still not off, which uh, really sucks. Let's see if uh, this next shot does it. Oh, yeah, there you go. We did it. Now we're good. We're just going to win. Sweet. Took a little bit of time. Took a little bit of damage, but honestly, I'm not concerned. Why don't we... Oh, my God. What the hell? Shields are down. Oh, crap. You guys go... Um... You guys go deal with that right the right the hell now. Oh my goodness. How, how the hell did that happen to our shields? I don't know. This is very, very bad. Oh my god. You guys got to fix that first? That sucks. Come on. Come on. Heal this. Heal this, please. Oh my god. I'm so worried. Okay, cool. Now bring this shield up, please. Oh, yes. All right. You guys, you guys go right the hell back uh, to where you're supposed to be and... Uh, I'm just gonna go send you down over here. We're gonna go just examine the ship to see if there's anything wrong with it I don't really think there is and um, everything everything looks good to me. Everything's back on track. We're gonna call this good. I Think uh, going down here should be should be all right. All right. Let's go uh, explore down over in this direction Oh my god another one of these things um, Okay, the pirate ship was a laying in wait turn and fight I can't believe, how was that, oh, okay, well, I guess we need to charge this up, okay, we're gonna go for, um, we're gonna go for their weapons, hopefully they don't, uh, ion fight us very much, come on, shoot, and then do some big damage, nice, oh, yes, that is such a good thing, okay, now what we can do is we can fire on their shields, and hopefully that's gonna do some big damage to them, uh, they're offering us four fuel, but, uh, eight scrap just ain't good enough, then we can fire on them again, and hopefully we're going to pierce their shields this time. And then what can we do? We can go right here. Okay. I think we're going to get this before the ion, but we will. Oh, okay. We did hit them. We got hit once by something. All right. But we're going to be healing this up, which is uh, quite good. Man, these asteroid fields are a pain in the old keister, meester. Okay. Well, uh, now that we are all healed up, let's just uh, wait until this goes, and uh, we'll see what's next. Jump. Uh, I would like to, well, first of all, let's just wait. Okay, jump. Let's jump to right here. That seems that seems good to me, honestly, in this moment. Ah, intervene and defend the outpost from this automated scout. I think so. Um, okay, let's hope it doesn't, don't hack anything annoying. Uh, okay, hack the clone bay. Feel, feel free. Uh, honestly, I mean, it's gonna, what is it gonna do with the clone bay? Like, nothing? Great. So we just go shoot, we miss, they hit the shields bay. That's okay, you can go there, and, uh, we're just gonna go hit you. That's fine, you can repair that. It'll be slow, but you can repair it. Okay, oh god, they hit our door system, which is fine. Now we're gonna go hit uh, their shields, because then, oh, we still didn't do any damn, damn damage. That's okay. Here we go, you, we bring you all the way back here. Oh my god, keep, we keep missing, that's not good. Well, alright, let's see if we can do anything here. Come on, can we at least damage it? You know, we hit the engines, that's one, that's one thing, it's kind of a positive. Let's see what we do on the next one. We fire. Oh, yeah, there you go. There go the shields. Uh, they're going to bring back their ion cannon. We're just going to go and fire on their weapons yet again. Boom. Oh, we also got uh, their hacking down, it seems. And let's go for one last shot. A final death blow right on the shields. And the... Wow. Well, that's not very nice of you. Okay, next one. Let's see how it does. Boom! Yeah, there you go. That's what I wanted to see. Oh my god. 
somebody out there has uh, got a small ding dong. They gotta, they gotta feel like they gotta rev their engine real loud for us. That's okay. Um, you know, it's starting to get a little bit hot, so the windows kind of have to be open. Um, because I live in an apartment, and they decide, oh yeah, May is too early to turn the air conditioning on. So, you know, what am I gonna do? Uh, t you know, complain on the internet, I guess. <laughs> So yeah, let's just go and uh, fire on their weapons as per usual. That's the uh, that's the pro strat that uh, we're doing here. Really would like. Oh, an ion pulse is imminent. That's not good. Um, well, let's hope it doesn't affect our weaponry. It doesn't, which is nice. And we're just gonna keep on firing on their weapons, which is good. Their weapons are gonna be down. And let's see if we can fire before the ion pulse. Fire. Very nice. We should probably win here. And boom. Yeah, we do. So we win continue and then we uh, can either uh, see well we gotta wait till our engine is charged which is gonna just take forever so we just wait pretty much ion pulse cool that's all right let's just wait and see well we have to you know wait for the engine to be good ion pulse is imminent okay cool well everything is fully charged up jump Next location should be uh, this one right here. Okay, let's make it uh, to this one and see what we have in the store here. You jump uh, into the battle, into the aftermath, what seems to have been a brutal exchange between several ships. Uh, wreck is drifts on screen. You can still see the remains of ships dying and sparkling. Let's investigate the battlefield. We don't find anything. Okay, next step, right here. I guess this is the uh, next stop. What do we find? We can purchase a uh, Mantis crew, but that's a very good opportunity for us to perhaps attack the Slaver Scum and mayhaps find ourselves uh, a new crew member if uh, that if they uh, give up the ghost, which I would love to see. Love to see them uh, giving up and then me being able to uh, come in and, and win, win the spoils of victory. I would be happy to see that. Engines are, you know, underpowered. Oh, goodness gracious. All right, next shot. Let's hope we can do a little bit better here. Come on, hit, hit them, hit them where it hurts. Right there. That's what I like to see. All right, let's go. Next shot. Come on, give a big, powerful blow here. Oh, you, you gotta be kidding me. All right, that's fine. Next, next, next thing's gonna be big old. Oh, miss and miss. I don't like the look of that at all. Not one bit. All right, come on. You do your job. Yeah. Oh, it's powering up its FTL. Okay, not good. We're gonna aim right on the target, right on the target, right on the pilot. Let's see if we can, uh, let's see if we can get them. Come on, come on, hit. Oh yeah, there you go, FTL delayed. It doesn't matter now uh, that the weapons are charging. All we really care about is just uh, keep delaying this. Uh, yes, we'll accept a uh, human crew. Okay, so for you, we uh, close down uh, this over here, uh, which is gonna be good because that means that we will be able to uh, send human into right here and uh we can unpo uh, actually we'll we'll keep you in here for a second as we just um you know keep keep stuff going on so we're gonna send you in there great and voila now we've got somebody in here which is quite nice um seems to be good 118 scrap that's not too much but it's not too little so a uh, next step has to be here unfortunately and uh, then we're going to see where we go. We don't have any sensors anyway, so what's the big diff? It's powering up its FTL drive. Uh, that's fine. We're just going to, since it's one of these, it's not going to be very powerful at all. We're just going to aim right on the uh, piloting center. They might get a pot shot off on us, and if they do, well, then screw them. They missed, which is great, uh, because then we can go and hit that. And then we can go hit this. Come on. All right, no, they hit us again. They're going to fire a shot. They're going to miss us again. Very nice. Uh, very good. So we got that down. Now let's go uh, hit this. See how well we can do. Oh, no, it's going to take a few uh, few moments here. The FTL is still delayed on that, which is great to see, great to hear, great to feel, great to, s I don't know, eel. Uh, let's go fire right on their uh, piloting sector right here and see if we can uh, not do anything about that. So great. Boom, boom, ba-doom. Like to see that ship destroyed. Seven, three, one. Uh, we feel relief knowing that we destroyed uh, an innocent life. Well, I guess uh, all we can do is move to the exit. Maybe we'll be able to do a um, a bounce to that other uh, sector over there. Long range beacons. There's nothing. Well, I mean, we can at least go here. Honestly, so might as well check it out. 
see what's here, and then uh, jump back. Uh, pirate ship uh, arrives shortly after us. Uh, so I'm tending to avoid a ship. Let's attack. Let's attack the pirate. Okay, they'll move in to engage, which is fine with me. Um, going to attack their weapons. They might board us. Mm, I don't know. I don't know if they're going to board us. If they do, I... Okay, they're going to try and attack our clone bay, which is fine with me. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to go take you. And just going to go right into this room. Great. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know why this door is locked. But what we want to do is we're just going to go over here like this. And uh, while it's peaceful, it's just going to... Um, oh, my God. Why, why are you going there? Can you... Oh, you're going to go man oxygen? That's fine with me. Okay, cool. So we're just going to go shoot around it. I mean, it's just going to, like, die while it's wandering around here, which is great. Um, our, our door system isn't very good. So we're just going to just sit here while dead. Great. It hasn't even... Wasn't even able to do uh, anything more. It's powering up its FTL. So we're going to... Aim on the main FTL console here. Try and uh, get something good going. Boom. We got we got the ship. Boom, boom, ba-doom. Very nice. Oh, we uh, also get a Mantis crew. Jill. Okay, Jill. Jill, uh, we don't have a sensor room, so we're going to uh, lock this down right here. And um, we are going to uh, allow you to go right into uh, this sector right here, which is going to be an uh, oxygenated door chamber, making our doors more powerful and immune to uh, hacking, which should be quite nice. Should we put our human on shields or no? I guess we should keep it like that. Kind of think. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't really know what I think, honestly, at this moment. So that's totally fine with me. What have we got? Nothing. Great. So we can jump and back to the exit because it's really our only choice. First sector, we got some gold, but we didn't really get much else. Uh, next sector, I guess, Nebula or uh, NG Controlled. Why don't we go for NG Controlled and then we can try and hit all these reds in a row, which would be nice. Unless, uh, I don't know, there's very little that could make us go here. But uh, we're going to go for NG Controlled first off. I hate the Nebulas. Sometimes you get some really bad stuff there. More like it, just Ion Storm is my least favorite uh, thing ever. I hate the Ion Storms. So if I can avoid them, I'm going to be doing that. Fire isn't the biggest risk, especially on a ship like this. Fire doesn't really matter. So we're going to just be ignoring it. Uh, weapons are a concern. They're going to beam aboard our ship. We're going to be very careful to see where they beam aboard, as it's important. Intruders on board. Do we know where they are? We don't really know where they are. Okay, they're going to be coming right here, which uh, we're going to be creating a safe zone for us right there. Uh, just like that. Great, uh, we missed them completely. That's fine. Oh, they missed us. That's also good to see. Uh, I am going to go uh, with you right over here uh, like this. And then I'm just going to go like that. And uh, great, we got their weapons down, which is quite nice. Actually, I probably didn't really need to do that, but uh, I'm just going to be going over there. Uh, it's going to die if it if it goes. I don't know where where uh, that NG is planning on going. Maybe it got sucked back to the ship. It'd be nice to know, but um, I think I can just go right here and uh, lock that down. Um, I don't know if there's a fire anywhere I need to worry about. Looks like uh, the teleportation bay has a fire in it right now, but that's actually not a big deal. Uh, ain't no problems with that, to be honest. Fire in the teleportation chamber, uh, all we can really do is just, you know, wait that out. As long as there's no fire in the rooms that are lit up, there ain't no problem with that. So, I can, I'm just going to keep firing on this. Sure, it takes a long time. Maybe I'll... Oh, God. Okay, so we have an NG right now. Was able to break through uh, this door. So, all I really need to do is just go right over here like this. Oh, my God, there's a fire there. Okay, well, fine. You... There, you, you go you go put out shit like that. There you go. You just go deal with that. I don't know. Oh, you're going to go fix this? That's fine with me. Okay, cool. So, look, this guy's just going to die. Oh, thank God he didn't die in a room that I was in because he could have damaged some of our crew. Um. Did Wait, hold on. Did they give up? Oh, did I accidentally accept a uh, surrender? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, that was very silly of me if I did. Uh, jump. Well, I guess we might as well go to a store right now. Ugh, damn, what did I accept? Dang it, I didn't know, I didn't I didn't really pay attention. That re That's really bad. 
The NG can do remarkable things with just a pile of scrap. Uh, NG have hit the... B oh, maybe uh, all their crew died. Oh, that would that'd be cool. Alright, cool. So, what have we got here? Uh, we can get sensors. We can get cloaking. We might as well get sensors, because that's going to make our mind control a lot more powerful. And we might as well fix all. Okay, fix all, step number one. Sensor is step number two. Drone is with a defense drone, but this beam... We could get a beam drone, which would be which would be pretty sweet. Uh, drone control for 85, and then a beam drone. Drone control, final slot. Do we want that to be drones? Teleportation, mind control, and then drones. Is that really what we want? I think we want cloaking as our final one, and not drones. So I'm going to wait, honestly, on that. I don't really think there's any need. There's no need for any fuel or anything like that. So 95 is good. Uh, now what can I do? I can go right over here like this. We're going to get uh, you fixed up. So now we can actually see our ship, which is quite nice. Nice feature uh, about uh, getting that. Uh, now what I want to do is I want to go to ship. I want to get this upgrade. Then I want to... Uh, maybe I can go one, two. One, ooh, can't do the second one. But that's okay because I can... If there's no risk of uh, that dying, I can just go right over here like this. And then things should be uh, quite a bit better. So there you go. I can, uh, f you know, target uh, target someone... Uh, do a lot of cool stuff, and then maybe I can upgrade this a little bit later too, and uh, do even more. So we've got a pretty good got a pretty good setup here. Why don't we uh, just uh, milk it till the cows come home? Yeah, that can we can we can go up there like that. So sweet. She. This is going to. Let's see what happens at this sector. Uh, let's fight the automated ship to get the storage cache. There's a beam drone there, so we're gonna fire right on there. Uh, ain't nothing in nobody else's ship. So as long as we can fire off and hit that before they can fire off and hit us. Okay, well, we actually deactivated their beam with their drone, which is actually a really nice, really nice thing. Because that beam was about, that drone was about to F us up. Actually, it wasn't because I forgot. I actually got a second bar of shields. Man, that was, um, that was, that was good timing. Okay, well, you know, we can, we can just keep going like this then. Um, it'd be, hacking would be another good one. I really want to become, like, much more powerful. So I would like uh, to get some lasers on this ship. I think that'd be that'd be a cool idea. Uh, no, we're just gonna go back on the weapons over here. Make sure that uh, none of these bad boys come back. Boom, one damage. It's not very much. Why don't we go for uh, the engines? See if we can deal with that. Boom, misses. Two misses. Two big misses. All right, you're gonna go right here under fire. Come on, let's do it. Let's do it to it. Boom. Okay, finally the engine's gonna be last. It's gonna be me. Uh, whatever, it doesn't really matter. Boom. One. Let's see what's the next one gonna be. It fires on us. Ain't nobody got time for that. Makes no difference. There you go. They are dead. So 22. Investigate the station and an anti-combat drone, which is good. I could sell that. Well, I'm gonna say hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And as always, I will be seeing you guys next time. Oh yeah. Do the royalty free music. Three, two, one, go. Come on, everybody, get on your feet. Stand up, look at the screen, and repeat. I'm gonna like, rate, comment, and subscribe. I love watching Aether vids all of the time. Thanks for dropping by and spending the time. Hope you've enjoyed, and let's get on with our lives. Oh, yeah. Thanks to Kevin McLeod for these awesome beats. Oh, yeah. Have a good one.